Hi there, welcome to the Songwriters Chord Club number 16. Today I'm going to show you a cool kind of chord. These are called, uh, can be called slash chords. There's some other names for them too, but basically it's playing one chord over a different bass note. What I'm going to show you today is an F over G. This chord is often used by uh, Pat Metheny and a lot of other people too, just to add a nice bit of color. It's almost jazzy but just a pretty interesting kind of chord. And here I'll show you what I'm actually doing. It's basically an F major seven, if you know this F major seven. So open E, first string on the B, or second, or uh, open E string, first fret on the B string, second fret on the G string, third fret on the D string, and then on the low E string, on the third fret, this is an F over G. And the way to use this is instead of a regular G seven, so if you're playing a progression like C to A minor to F to G, very standard progression. That last chord, if you're playing a G7, instead of playing a G7, so once again, to the F, the G7, instead of playing that, you can play this chord or resolving to that C. It's just a pretty interesting sound. Instead of a regular G7, like that, or this, however you want to play it. This is a pretty interesting sound, like that. So you can use it in place of any um, of any seventh chord. You just want to uh, change the root. So instead of you know, like say a C7 up here, if you're playing like like that, just do like this, like that. You don't use your open E string in that case. You just use. Play in the 8th fret of the e, low E string, 8th fret of the D string, 7th fret on the G string, 6th fret on the B. So instead of a C7, like that. It's a pretty interesting sound. I mean, it's kind of a folky sound. It has a unique, kind of a unique tone to it. So I hope it's useful. Let me know any comments or questions you might have. Thanks for watching.